this is pretty easy. If there's any chance that you want to use student loans to help your kid start building their credit, if there's any chance that you might want to appeal a financial judgment and you want to be on a good standing, if you make less than a half a million a year in income, you should fill out the FAFSA. We consistently have families that say, oh, well, you know, we make 200,000 and so there's just no way that we're gonna get, and we've seen families that make 450 that still get financial aid or that still have reasons why filling out their financial aid forms was a really, really good deal. Despite the fact, like setting, setting that aside, there's also a possibility that somebody may lose their job, that, you know, something may happen. We have like divorce and death and all kinds of things that happen in life that we have no control over. And so generally the best thing, even for risk mitigation is to go out and fill out, out that FAFSA every single year. And then whenever you, you filled it out, if something happens that year, and somebody loses their job, somebody gets disabled, then you can go back and you can ask for that financial aid. So even if you don't need the money, it's good just for a risk preparedness measure.